Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and today we're gonna be talking about the new pretty cool feature in the chat GPTs which is called the reasoning feature and if you have been following the AI tools for a while you may already know about the DeepThink R1 well this feature feels like the ChatGPT's version of that so let's break it down and talk what it's all about ChatGPT recently added this new button called reasoning when you click on it ChatGPT doesn't just give you the right answer it takes some time to think through the problem and explain it step by step so it is like having a conversation with AI where it actually walks you through its thought process. Now if you had a chance to use a deep seek and you probably had because honestly it's been a pretty hot topic lately you're probably already familiar with how it works and personally I lean toward the tools like Cloud for my personal own project since it's really convenient and I'm really used to this I'm really used to using Cloud's features like projects so like this uh, writing style and so, so on that's not the main subject of this video let's just put this aside it will be really interesting just to compare how ChatGPT and DeepSeek performs in this way and which one stands out here. I have put together five prompts to test both DeepSeek and ChatGPT's reasoning feature. These ones cover things like multi-step problem solving, ethical reasoning, scientific analysis and abstract pattern recognition. DeepSeek spent two and a half minutes solving the problem, carefully showing each step of its thought process. In contrast, ChatGPT completed the same task in just 33 seconds, presenting a clear and organized solution. So while both AI models arrived at the correct solution, their approaches were distinctly different. DeepSeek provides detailed reasoning similar to a thorough academic explanation. ChatGPT offers a streamlined, efficient response perfect for quick problem solving. So what does this really mean for you? If you are someone who loves diving into the details, exploring the why behind the answers or tackling really complex problems, both tools have their strengths, but of course, in my opinion, DeepSeek is definitely something that worth checking out because it is much better for education, scientific challenges and complex reasoning. And for now, DeepSeek's combination of depth, accessibility and cost effectiveness makes it a really standout choice for, for me and probably for the most of the users. So that's just my personal opinion on that. So that's it for this video. If you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. And if you've tried ChatGPT's reasoning feature or DeepSeek's reasoning feature, let me know in the comment section below. I really would love to to hear about your thoughts and your experiences. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Take care.